Hey guys, this is Taste PvP here, and I'm back um, with the render test now. But one thing to make your videos smoother: make sure you click on lock frame rate while recording on 120 frames. I was messing around with it, and it is a lot smoother when you lock it. So yeah. Uh, hey guys, this is Taste PvP, and I'm back showing you the render settings. Um, this is a video I recorded. Um, basically to show off the settings uh it's actually a really really good one i just recorded this i don't know how long ago 45 minutes ago maybe um anyway uh it's quite good showing everything really like it's got ma a lot of mouse movements items dropping sword swinging turning and jitter clicking all in the same video and i get like three kills so um the yeah the reason I have picked these render settings is because they look so so nice compared to a lot of the WMV uh, settings. Um, you can still use WMV, and I'll talk about that in the video. But like the settings that I've picked, uh, they work really well for me, and I have been using them, uh, especially the what is it, the hardcore games. Epic Feast Fight, I used these settings in there, and they looked really, really nice. Uh, and I think MC Teams Let's Play 5. Uh, but I have been messing around with my settings, so they have been changing, but they are two videos that I am for sure I use these settings in. Um, so yeah, as you can see watching this video... <laughs> Some guy actually calls hacks on me and says that I'm using a sharp three sword, but I showed both sharp the uh, the sharp one sword, and you know I'm using five zig, and I'm zooming and using optifine, so the chances of me hacking are pretty low. Plus, you watched the whole video, so yep, uh, that's about it for um, the video. But yep, if the guy who I wreck and called hacks on me watch is this um you know sincerely fuck you sir okay i am back with a render settings thing you know instead of the fraps um i've been having strange issues but i think i figured them out so this is going to be my third time recording this um but yeah so put your video clip in here. Um, I don't have to do that it's just because I've got sound there that I don't want. So like no, or you could just you know press U delete, you know whatever separate the clips. Um, and I've got music here that I want. So you know do the normal stuff, fade in, fade out, you know all, all that all that cool stuff, you know. Um, so yeah, it's all good. Like this, X Y. And at the end, you know, like, swag. So, first of all, um, these are my project properties. 1280 by 720, 180 frames per second, so it doesn't lag in, like, the preview there. 8-bit, um, best, Gaussian blend fields. Don't adjust that. Do not adjust that, K. Okay? Then start on your these settings apply. So yep. And then right click on your video file. Properties. Uncheck maintain aspect ratio. And uh, okay. So yeah you don't have any of those black bars. They're all there. And then click on render test. Um, and then. Go to like. I don't know like. This internet HD 720p or something. Um. Make it uh, 1280 by 720. Uh, oh my god, my eye. Okay, so 1280 by 720. Do not allow source to adjust frame size. Um, keep that on main 29.97. Um, yep, 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 yep. And then this bit is the bit that we need to kind of look at uh, you, what you want to uncheck this 
and um, for my exact settings, I use this. It takes a long time to upload, though. That's the only problem. But if you're fine with waiting, well, I'll put I'll put my speed test results um, on the screen now, and I'll link it in the description so you can find out what yours are. But that's my download and upload. Um, so I have to look, I have to wait a really long time for it to upload. But I use these settings because they're high quality anyway. Um, so yeah, um, audio, use that, um, if you don't care too much and you're trying to cut down on file size, um, unless you're, you have music in the video that's like the prime sound, then use this, 192. System, check GPU, if it says CUDA or OpenGL is available, then change encode mode to Render using GPU if available. Render faster. Project good. Uh, for some reason, best doesn't work for me. I don't know why. And then YouTube HD. You know, fail right there. Save and just start rendering. And what the fuck? Okay, well, for some reason, I have some other settings that are exactly the same. You can look here, apart from encode mode, but I just tried that on the other one exactly the same and for some reason it works don't know why but it does so if those settings don't work I have a solution for you it's probably Vegas Pro 11 that is stopping you from actually getting to use it but uh, yeah so if those work for you and you can actually render, then good. But if not, I do have a backup. Um, let me find okay, it. Okay, so go to Windows Media Video V11. Uh, go to this, customize. Um, just keep this all the same. Uh, you want to go that to 100. Keep Keep the rest of this the same. Unless, if you want to render really fast, um, because you have a, like, a really bad PC or something, change this to Windows Media Video V7. Looks a bit worse, but it renders a hell of a lot faster. Anyway, bit rate 7. Project Best Backup Render. Save and render that so yep if the other one doesn't work for you this also works and it also looks good so thanks for watching and uh peace out